Good evening. Welcome to the class. How are you? Good evening. Good evening, Miss. Good evening, Miss. Class. How do you feel? I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. Thank yes. You. An allergy. So good. I'm taking I'm taking my, my medicine, so eh, it's good. Or, or is not here the allergy now. <laughs> Sometimes when I'm in the middle of the class, I start sneezing, and I don't like that. Okay, but welcome, welcome everyone for that punctuality and being here on time. I know some students are even before I connect. <laughs> Um, I hope that you have worked on the platform because we need to be working on the platform, as you know. So hopefully you have finished the section number one by today, right? And uh, we're going to do a review of the section one as well. Remember today, um, no, I mean, today we're going to do the review of section one. Tomorrow we're going to be starting section two. And remember, uh, we only have three more weeks. So basically, um, yeah, three more weeks to go. We're gonna be finishing by the end of this month with this module, okay? So, um, did you, platform, did you complete section one? Yes. Yeah? Yes, miss. Yes? Yes, miss. So I hope you did. If you didn't, you still have tonight, okay? I'm gonna give you tonight, like, the time for you to complete it, then I'm going to check your grades because I'm going to stay up um, late tonight and I'm going to tell you what I mean. I'm going to upgrade your note today to send them the report, right? You know, every week I have to send a report of everyone's grade. <laughs> finish uh, the platform or if you're not uh, working on the platform, you still have tonight. I want to check because I can check um, the grades. Let me see. I have here and I can be, okay, the grade. So section one, it says Adan completed it, Carlos, Daniel. Well, Daniel still has some to do. Edgar de Nilsson has not completed. Okay, so I'm just going to say the names. Solo voy a decir los nombres de quienes no, 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 like, didn't finish the platform, que no hemos completado la plataforma, okay? Solo esos nombres. Okay, so it says Edgar Edenilson, um, Germán Alejandro, Jorge, no, José Ernesto Alemán, uh, Karen Berenice Castro, Mar Marlon Fabricio Flores. Let me check. Miguel Ángel Cortés. Okay, esos son los que no han trabajado. Nothing, right? Like nada, because those are the ones. Y ahí los que también tienen un avance, pero les falta. A ver, hay unos que me parecen con el 80% que podrían terminar más, ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, Daniel Sifontes aparece con 88%, podría avanzar más. Igual Edwin Alexis, 80%. Gabriela Yamilet, 80%. Mario Antonio Reyes, 80%. Y Miguel Ángel solo tiene 20%. Salvador Orlando dice 96, que es un 9.6. Y Sara Raquel Chávez, que tiene un 87%. De ahí, eh, los demás tienen 100%, los menciono rápidamente. Sergio Adolfo, Noé Gabriel, Noé Aníbal, Mauricio Antonio, Adán Antonio. Carlos Amilcar, Esmeralda del Rosario, Jonathan Estandes, 
Jorge Ernesto, Marco Antonio, en Mario Cristóbal y Marvin Enrique Arguello, Arguello, Arguello perdón. So, ellos sí tienen el 100%, ¿ok? So, eh, ya están ahí sus notas, ya saben ustedes, si no han terminado trabajo. Bueno, go... eh, I am Gisela, but I don't, I don't hear my name. Para la plataforma, ¿y está trabajando en la plataforma? Fíjese que yo ingresé, pero me no me aparece el módulo, solo me aparece el módulo 4. Vaya, entonces escríbale a los gestores de inglés corporativo para que me le ayuden a, a inscribirse, ¿okay? porque si no me aparece en el listado. Ambas, perfecto, gracias. Escríbales ahí en el grupo, ahí en el grupo creo que están los gestores, los que aparecen con la foto de inglés corporativo, a ellos pueden escribirle. Va, está bien, gracias. Porque estas personas son las que ayudan con lo administrativo, ¿verdad? So, thank you very much, pero gracias por estar pendiente de sus nombres. Ok, let's go with the attendance for today. It's 8.07 already, so we need to go with that. Let's see. Adán Antonio Ramírez Aguirre. Carlos Amilcar Campos Palencia. Present. Daniel Enrique Sifontes Perdomo. Presente. Edgar Edenilson Reyes Portillo. Presente. Edwin Alexis Pérez Hernández. Esmeralda del Rosario Portillo García. Recuerden mantener sus audios apagados, please, solo para decir present, los encendemos. Um, Gabriela Yamilet Ramírez Ceciliano. Present, Miss. Okay. Eh, Jonathan Stanley Pérez López. Present, Miss. Jonathan, eh, oh, yeah, okay. Jorge Ernesto López Rivera. Present, Miss. José Ernesto Alemán García. Karen Berenice Castro Avelar. Present. Marco Antonio Vanegas Corleto. Present, Miss. Mari, Mario Antonio Reyes Berganza, Berganza. Present. Mario Cristóbal Quintanilla. Mar, Marlon Fabricio Flores Vargas. ¿No? Marvin Enrique Ar, Arguello Joaquín. No, ok. Gracias, Miss. Oh, ok. Mauricio Antonio Rivera Rojas. Miguel Ángel Cortés Campos. Present. Noé Aníbal González López. Present, Miss. Noé Gabriel Pérez Martínez. Salvador Orlando Veracruz Gámez. Gómez. Sara Raquel Chávez Morán. ¿No? Ok. Uh, Sergio Adolfo Hernández Rosales. Rosales. En Gisela Guadalupe Martínez Cruz. Present. Deme un segundo. Okay, you guys, let's go here um, with the last class. In the last class, we were practicing a conversation about should and shouldn't, right? <coughs> so if you can see, this is the conversation, right? And the conversation talk about different things in a company and like an advice, like should we do this, should we do that, and the new things they have to do in the company, okay? So, uh, and they were talking about uh, changing the machines that they are working with because they should be in the 21st century and they should be using new machines, right? So, now, to talk about should and shouldn't, in this case, should and shouldn't, we use it to give advices, okay? 
So this is not like an obligation that people have to do, but it's like an advice. So you should do this. I'm not telling you that you have to do it because have to is like an obligation or must is an obligation, but should is like an advice. For example, I said, uh, to practice your English, you should speak uh, with your classmates or you should uh, listen to podcasts in English. You should watch cartoons in English. And I'm telling you cartoons, okay? Because many people ask me all the time, Miss, I, I am um, watching TV series in English, but I cannot understand. And I say, okay, so what kind of TV series or shows are you watching in English? And they say, I'm watching, uh, I don't know, House, Dr. House. Or I'm watching, um, I don't know, like uh, Grey's Anatomy. And I'm like, are you really? Yo ni en español les entiendo esas series a veces. So, and you want to understand that in English? So, no, no, no. So, they use medical terms. They use complex vocabulary. So, for your English level, that is not the appropriate things that you should be watching. For example, if you want to learn English and you don't have like the level, you should start with cartoons. Dora the Explorer. I don't know any type of cartoon that you can watch and is easy vocabulary. Okay. So if I, I can tell you an advice is it is you should watch TV series with easy vocabulary or easy to understand. For example, cartoons like um, Dora the Explorer and all the cartoons that are for little kids, because that is going to help you to acquire new vocabulary. And it's really easy to understand. So just talking about should and shouldn't, we're gonna continue with that. And I'm gonna show you the structure on how we use should. Okay, so obviously we always need a subject first, then we need should, oh, sorry, should or shouldn't, then we need the verb, and then we need a complement. For example, let's make an example. You should, and then the verb in the base form, okay? You should um, practice your pronunciation, okay? This is an advice. Another advice that can go with shouldn't is you shouldn't eat that much, okay? Because maybe you're gonna get sick. Just I'm giving you an advice, right? Let's continue. Um, she should, and if you pay attention to the pronunciation of should, I don't say the letter L. I don't say should, right? I say should, should. Okay, so she should um she should be on time. Okay, ya debería llegar a tiempo. He shouldn't text and drive. No debería manejar y ver mensajes, right? So if you pay attention, the rule it's followed. For example, here we have the subject, wait, you, then we have should, then we have the verb, and then we have the complement, right? So in every one of these cases, I'm looking at the subject, wait. subject, auxiliary or modal verb shouldn't or should the main verb in the sentence eat because always um it is followed by the by the main verb and then of course we have the complement once again subject auxiliary or modal verb should the verb to be in the complex. Once again, subject, 
modal verb should, the verb, well, in this case, we have two verbs, right? Text and drive are two verbs. Okay? So this is the structure to talk about advices, should and shouldn't, okay? Do you have questions so far? No questions? Okay. If there are no questions, then we're gonna continue. Now, send me to the Zoom chat. Two examples, using should, one using should, and one using shouldn't, okay? Here, to the Zoom chat. Send two examples, one using should, and one using shouldn't. In chat of Zoom or WhatsApp? Zoom chat. Okay, I'm checking your sentences in the chat. Thank you to the people that are sending the sentences. Early by her work. For her work, maybe? If we be doing it too fast. I shouldn't wake up early. <laughs> I should study a lot. Okay. Should put attention in class. Pay attention. In English, is pay attention, okay? Not put attention, it's pay attention. Should traje arrest after we should traje arrest? 
we should take a rest. We should take a break, maybe, that you wanted to say. Take a break. We should return late. You should breakfast enough. You should have breakfast, okay? So it's have breakfast. Breakfast is not a verb. Have breakfast. Enough to have it in your day. Shouldn't in love so easy. You shouldn't fall in love so easy. You shouldn't fall in love. You shouldn't smoke here. Okay, well, so far, I'm understanding that you are understanding here these topics, okay? How should and shouldn't is used. Basically, it's used to talk about advices that we are giving to other people. Now, we're going to do an activity in this moment. Let me show you what is the activity we're going to do. Give five advices to learn English. Give five advices to avoid distractions during the class. And give five advices to study online. Okay, so what you're going to give me is 15 advices total. The first fifth, five advices will be about how to learn English. Then you're going to give me five advices to avoid distractions, evitar distracciones during the class. And the next, you're going to give me five advices to study online. Cinco consejos para estudiar en línea, right? So this is, you're going to make it with your group. All the group is going to participate in this. So total would be 15 advices, 15 consejos, the first five, como aprender inglés, the second five, como evitar distracciones en clases, and the next five, como estudiar en línea. Advices. What is an advice? What is an advice? In Spanish? Yeah, you can say it in Spanish. Consejos. 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 So that's what you're going to do. Let me, um, I'm going to send you the screenshot just to be really clear about the activity we're doing in this moment. Okay, there we go. Do you understand the activity? Yeah. Do we get it? So I have oyente. Sara dice que está oyente. Yeah. Um, listener Marlon, Adán, Salvador. Oh my God, I have a lot of oyentes. Why is that? It's Monday. <laughs> I can see that. Okay, let's go. There you have the invites.
Marvin, you can participate. Okay, pero no me aparece un nido. Ya le voy a enviar la invitación de nuevo, ¿ok? Bueno, voy a mandar a la 3, pero no se vaya a unir a la 3 porque la suya es la 2. Cuando le caiga la invitación de la 2, se une. Ahí, ahí puede unirse.
Hello, Aníbal. Hello. ¿Se desconectó? Eh, tengo mala conexión, por eso me estoy desconectando cada rato. ¿Quiere apagar la cámara para que la conexión mejore? No, ya me conecté en la compu. Ya, gracias. ¿Y en qué sala estaba? <risa> estaba con Daniel, con... Eh, Sara. Daniela, Karen, Sara, ok. Ah, exactly. Ok, entonces, number two, ok. Thank you, Miss.
Sí, 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 Ajá, quítele todo y póngale no playing games para no complicar. Y ha apelado la primera decisión del juez. Y así mientras Israel está siendo atacado, mientras Ucrania está siendo atacada, mientras la inflación... No playing games. Yo estoy aquí, no todos son oponentes políticos. Son ataques de la administración Ah, uh, Breaks, did with two decisions. Yes. El juicio podría ser uh, este miércoles y todavía no está claro cuántos testigos. Uh, Andrea González, voz de América, Nueva York. En Rusia, según fuentes cercanas What? al Kremlin, Vladimir Putin decidió presentarse uh, a la Bayes, que en el poder. A copy este. book uh, ah. to take, take note. Uh, you, you should have uh, notes or copybook. Uh -huh. O sea, tener yes. el, el, el cuaderno. Yes. Yes.
Oh my God, are you watching soccer games or something like that? The Luis Angel Firpo dicen. I watch, I watch my mom, my mom watch TV, in TV news. She's watching the news, I bet, right? She watch, she watches the, the news. Yes. <laughs> okay, excellent. Okay. Um. So I went to the breaker rooms, and you were practicing some breaker rooms. Uh, like most of the breaker rooms I went to, they finished already with the activity. But especially, I went to one breaker room, and while I was there, they weren't speaking. Apagaron este. ¿Cómo se llama esto? La apagaron los audios. Apagaron las cámaras. And nothing, right? So I was like, oh my God, what is happening here? Así que no supe qué pasó en ese break room. Ay, se me borraron en los break rooms que estuvieron ustedes. Déjenme un momentito. No, 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 no se vayan a unir, no se vayan a unir. Se me borraron los break rooms. Bueno, pero cada quien sabe en cuál estaba. Um, we're going to go with group number. Okay, we're going to share. Here. Recuerden que si ya terminaron, ustedes pueden estar practicando. Speaking, you can be doing many things. Okay, group number two. Who was group number two? ¿Quién era en el group number two? No que I estaba... don't remember. I don't remember. <laughs> okay. Um, um, que Daniel estaba ahí. Yes, I remember. <laughs> me. Mm -hmm. Bueno, mi, en mi grupo está entonces Marco, yes. Gabriela, Aníbal, Karen, Marvin, okay. Adán y Edwin. Okay. Va, entonces voy a compartir pantalla con lo que hicimos. Okay. Remember, everyone has to participate, okay? Okay. Okay, I, I start. Five advice to learn English. First, we should take an English class. We shouldn't speak Spanish, just English. We should have the time and availability. We should pay attention in the class. Okay. Number five, we should practice with the placement. Okay, thank you. Fire advice, avoid distraction during the class. First, we should off the TV. Sería, we should turn off the TV. Turn off. Turn off. Turn off. Yeah. Turn off Which, the TV. Okay. The number Next. two, and we should stay alone. Number three, we should we should uh, eat during the class. Number four, we think that the family is one of the distractions in some <laughs> cases. For this reason, we 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 shouldn't speak with the family during the class. Okay. <laughs> we shouldn't watch part. social media. <laughs> We shouldn't check social media. It will be better with ah, it. Okay. We shouldn't check. Check. Okay. Okay. Next. Check social media. Okay. And finally, five advice to study online. We should have a good connection. Uh, online, put it all together. Online. No, 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 there, up, 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 don't they say five? No, no, five no, advices no. online, all together. Where it says five advices to study online. 
Nine. Okay, yeah. All together. Yeah, okay, excellent. The next, we, <clears throat> we should have equipment or tools. Okay. Yes, and one is the important thing that <laughs> we shouldn't sleep during the class. Yeah, that is a very good one. <laughs> Number four, we should we have... <laughs> Ladies first. Gabriela, <laughs> We should have charge the cell phone or computer. And the finally, we should have the student's manual. Okay, perfect. Okay, thank you. Yes, good job. Just give them an applause. Good job. You did a good job. Okay. So, but you have the student's manual. It's in the, it's on the platform, right? And you have to download it. Okay. Excellent. Let's go here with group number. Let's see. Let's see what the roulette says. Oh, sorry. Take a pause. Oh, 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 close. So group number three. Um, group number three. Jorge, yo creo que usted es el one. Así que no creo que sea el three. Okay. We are the four. Who is the group number three? ¿Quién es el group number three? Los que tenían una presentación PowerPoint que estuvieron en silencio cuando llegué a la sala. Okay. Okay, we are the number three. <laughs> the silent boys. <laughs> okay, we finish very fast, it means. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> because we are the better. Okay. okay. <laughs> first, first Jonathan and then Noé. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Then Amilcar. Uh, I don't remember number uh, name the girl. Mauricio. Mauricio. Oh, the girl. Um, there was a girl. Esmeralda. 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 Yes. Esmeralda. Okay. Okay. Yes. okay. Number four, Esmeralda, and me number five. Okay. Give okay. okay. advice to learn English. We should watch movie in English language. Number two, we should read books in English. We should listen to music in English. Number four, we should study English every day. Number five, we should practice with our classmates. Good. Okay. Get, get five advices to about distraction during the class. Number one, we shouldn't watch cell phone during the class. Number two, we shouldn't watch TV on the class. Number three, we shouldn't take English class in Tibet. Number four, we shouldn't play with our pet during the class. Number five, we shouldn't eat on the class. And uh, finally, give five advices to study online. Number one, we should use headphones. Number two, we should have good internet connection. Number three, we should use the computer during the class. Number four, we should pay attention during the class. And number five, we should participate during the class. Aha! Uh -huh. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Good job. Uh -huh. Excellent. We participate means we participate. Participate is the word that you want to listen, right? I know, I know, I know. Yeah, participation. Yes. Good job. Excellent to everyone that participated in this activity. Excellent. Thank you. Excellent. Good job. Thank you.
Okay, so this is a pretty easy topic. It's about just should and shouldn't um, it, to give advices, right? Um, with the modal verbs, usually we don't add to um, because when we have two verbs together, like I want to eat, so you need to use the to, right? But with the modal verbs, you don't need to use it. Like the modal verbs, could, should, must. Audios open. Okay. Okay. So I was saying, um, so uh, should is a modal verb, could is a modal verb, um, can is a modal verb, must is a modal verb. So all these modal verbs, they help to modify the meaning of the verb in the sentence so they don't need an auxiliary or something else to complete the sentence. And also, niegan por si solos. Okay. So for example, could is couldn't. Should is shouldn't, can is can't, uh, must is mustn't. So that the only modal verb, or this is to talk about obligation, that uses the to is have to, okay? Like I have to um, speak during the class, or I don't have to um, sleep during the class. And those advices you gave, uh, they are pretty good. Me gustaron los advices that don't sleep during the class. You shouldn't sleep during the class. Yeah, that's a good advice. I recommend to follow that advice porque yo los que no veo las cámaras, yo no sé si están sleeping. I don't know if you're sleeping or not, right? Uh, uh, it can be, it can be. Ay, Mari, rapidito. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, you, you can be sleeping and I don't know. Marvin too, right? Excellent. <laughs> because they, if I don't see you, I don't know what you're doing, right? So, um, yes. So, follow those advices. Those advices are for you and you made those advices, so it's good. Okay, now you guys, let's go here um, with the next part that we have in the manual. This is a pretty easy activity to do. It's pretty simple. And this is the last with shouldn't, shouldn't. Then we're gonna go with the review of this unit number one. So here we have um, different sentences and we need to add should or shouldn't depend how it corresponds. So for example, we have the number one that says, or products be fresh. What do you think? Should or be products fresh. Should or shouldn't? Should be fresh. Should. Be fresh. Should. So that's what you're gonna do. You're the only right, should, okay? I'm gonna send you this so you can work together. And remember, uh, so I'm gonna give you like five minutes stops activity because this is pretty easy activity. Okay. And then we're gonna come here and I'm gonna ask some participants to tell me the full answers. Okay. There you go. Remember to participate. It is very important to participate. See, I have a lot of oyentes lately. Okay, there, let's go. <clears throat> Miss, what happened? I don't have the invitation. Okay, let's see. You are Noe, 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 Noe. Okay, uh, Noe, you're going to the break room number two. Pero le voy a enviar a la tres. Okay. Para... Se le enviar. No se vaya a unir a la tres. No se vaya a unir. Okay. At number two, yes. Accepted. Okay, thanks.
Hello, José Ernesto. Hello, Miss. Good evening. Good evening, welcome. Thank you. Okay, I'm going to send you to a break room. Hello, welcome to the jungle. Hello. Welcome to the jungle. Okay, Hello. let's see the answers. Okay, so number one is obviously our products should be fresh, right? Number two, please, uh, let's see, let's see. I'm gonna go with Mauricio Antonio Rivera. Yes, miss. Uh, number two. Number please. two. Yeah. This company shouldn't forget about quality. Repeat, shouldn't? Shouldn't. Okay. Shouldn't. Choose the next participant, please. Mm, why? Mm, Daniel Enrique Sifontes. Daniel Enrique Sifontes. Okay. We should explore new markets. Okay, thank you. Let me choose. Well, yo voy a elegir el siguiente. Thank you. Uh, Carlos Amilcar. Eh, diga, diga Carlos Amilcar, yes. <laughs> Carlos Amilcar. Okay, thank you. Okay. The machinery shouldn't be old. Okay. Now choose Sergio Adolfo. Uh, Sergio. Okay. <laughs> All the employees should use the machinery. 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 Okay, thank you very much. Yes. Okay, so if you have it like this, then it is correct. Okay, now let's continue. And here we're going to go with a little bit of a review of the unit number one of the section number one here on page number 17. Okay, and we're going to practice a little bit of vocabulary. And but we're going to start with this conversation. Okay. So let's go. 
you want to read it, remember the first time is pronunciation and the second time is intonation. We were very, very, listen, you guys, when you say the word is very, very, it's not very, very, very se llama una señora, Betty in English. Betty, very, no. It's very, I am very happy. Porque si usted dice, I am very happy, usted está diciendo, yo soy Betty feliz. No soy muy feliz. Okay. Remember, the pronunciation of the letter V is V. V. It's not B la biodental. ¿Sí ve? V. V. Y una pequeña vibración. V. 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 Por eso es que todas esas veces que decían ustedes que amaban a la otra persona y le decían, I love you. Ese amor no duró porque lo decían mal. ¿Ok? Porque si es I... Pues estábamos bien. <ríe> es I love... De haberlo sabido. <ríe> love, love. Thank you. It's not love. It's love. So, every... Porque ya he visto que esa, esa letter B está haciéndonos un... little bit of a problem there. For example, this word here. Wait a moment. Have... Have, no, have, have, no, have, have. Oh. Every word, turn over. B, b, b. Those words, they let it be, that you need to say it really good, okay? So I'm going to go one more time, but this is pronunciation. We were very busy yesterday. We had a lot of customers. We did, I think... We need to stock our inventory. Yes, we don't have enough quantity, quantity of chocolate caramel. Chocolate caramel. What was or listen this the inventory? Inventory. Inventory turnover for chocolate caramel what about the coast right now it's three for this year do you know what is inventory turnover you know the meaning of inventory turnover no no Okay, the number no. the number of time a company sell yeah exactly when you have to have new inventory because you sold everything right yes exactly so inventory turnover so they have turned over the inventory three times this year and the cost is $30 per unit that's great Okay, let's go one more time. We were very busy yesterday. We had a lot of customers. We did. I think we need to stock our inventory. Yes, we don't have enough quantity of chocolate caramel. What was our inventory turnover for chocolate caramel? What about the cost? Right now, it's three for this year. And the cost is $30 per unit. That's great. Okay. I'm going to send you the audio. We were very busy yesterday. We had a lot of customers. We did. I think we need to stock our inventory. Yes, we don't have enough quantity of chocolate caramel. What was our inventory turnover for chocolate caramel. 
what about the cost? Right now, it's three per, for this year. And the cost is 30 per unit. That's great. Ahí se me fue un per de más, ¿verdad? <laughs> Creo que era four y dije per. But it's four. No okay. So I'm going to send you the screenshot of this. Re let's go to practice pronunciation. Because that's what I want you to do first. Go with the pronunciation. Listen, I don't say a stock. I said stock, right? So let's go first with the pronunciation and then we go with the intonation. But first, let's go word by word with the pronunciation. Okay? So let's go to the breaker rooms to practice. Remember, we go to practice. Vamos a practicar. Nothing to do other things. We go to practice. Okay. Let me see. Tengo que intentar no mandar a todos los oyentes a la misma sala, porque si no. Okay, let's go.
Okay, now let's go with the intonation, okay? To don't sound like a robot. So we can sound a little bit more natural when speaking, okay? So it will be like that. We were very busy yesterday. We had a lot of customers. Like, cansado, tuvimos un montón de customers. Entonces, ¿cómo sería el tono? I will be in the intonation. We were very busy yesterday. We had a lot of customers. We did. Sí, sí que tuvimos un montón de customers, right? We did. I think we need to stock our inventory. Yes, we don't ha have enough quantity of chocolate caramel. What was our inventory turnover for chocolate caramel? And what about the cost? Right now, it's three for this year. And the cost is 30 per unit, $30 per unit. That's great. Okay, a little bit more natural, natural when speaking. One more time. We were very busy yesterday. We had a lot of customers. We did. I think we need to stock our inventory. Yes, we don't have enough quantity of chocolate caramel. What was our inventory turnover for chocolate caramel? What about the cost? Right now, it's three for this year. And the cost is $30 per unit. That's great. We were very busy yesterday. We had a lot of customers. We did. I think we need to stock our inventory. Yes, we don't have enough quantity of chocolate caramel. What was our inventory turnover for chocolate caramel? What about the cost? Right now, it's three for this year. And the cost is $30 per unit. That's great. Okay, you see the last audio was 48 seconds. This one is 30 seconds because when we speak naturally, it goes a little bit fast, okay? Now let's go with the intonation. And when we come back, I'm gonna choose some participants. A los que escucha más participativo con esas cámaras bien encendidas, ¿verdad? Sí. So a eso voy a pasar primero. Mentiras. So we're gonna go to the breaker rooms and the people, um, Right now, you're going to practice the intonation. When we come back, I want to hear you with the correct intonation for this. Okay, let's go.
is very per unit. That's great. Okay, just start. Okay. We were very, very busy yesterday. We had a lot of customers. Busy. We did. Busy, I'm sorry. We were very busy. Busy. Okay. We were we were very busy yesterday. We had a lot of customers. We did. I think we need to stop our inventory. Alguien conmigo? Okay. Partner. You are start. Okay. We were very, very busy yesterday. We had a lot of customers. We did. I think we need to. Yesterday, we we had a lot of customers. We did. I think we need to stock our inventory. Yes, we don't have enough quantity of chocolate caramel. What was our inventory turnover for chocolate caramel? Miguel, what happened? Se salió del grupo? Yes, Miss. ¿Y qué? Te... Me sacó el... ¿En cuál grupo estaba? Y... ¿O con quién? With whom? One with... With... Noé. Noé... Noé Pérez. Yes,
You guys, when I send you the audios, yo les mando los audios para que los practiquen, para que los escuchen, right? Hagan algo, escuchen el audio, grábense ustedes hablando, y luego digan, ¿lo estoy diciendo así? ¿O hay algo que estaré diciendo? ¿Ok? Porque a veces decimos algunas palabritas que si las repetimos tantas veces así, se hace una fosilización. A eso en inglés se le conoce como fossilization. ¿Qué pasa? Que yo digo una palabra tantas veces mal que mi cerebro se cree que así se dice. Y ya me cuesta mucho cambiarla, ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, busy. Es busy. ¿eh? Como bicicleta. Es busy. Que en inglés bicicleta es bicy. Bicycle. ¿eh? So remember. Hay que escuchar el audio. Intentar un poquito soft. Es que no sé cómo se decirlo en español, pero soft, el como suavizar, suavizar, perdón, como suavizar el, 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 el acento, ¿verdad? Que no se escuche tan fuerte. So, a little bit, por eso les mando dos veces. One for pronunciation and the other one for intonation. That's the audio, ahí lo tienen, escúchenlo. Vuelvan a leer la conversación ustedes solitos, grábense, luego escuchen, porque aquí el inglés, y no, yo mi, en mi cabeza pienso que hablo en inglés, perfect, right? Pero cuando tengo que decirlo, oh my goodness. Y yo dije, ya se fue yo. Y eso dije, no. Este le hace chain, right? So please, listen, escúchese, right? Para que podamos decirlo bien. No porque, a ver, me va a decir, ah, me va a criticar. No, porque no le van a entender. No le van a entender cuando hable. Y me suele decir, este, I am, bu I am busy, le va a decir. Y le va a decir, ¿el qué? ¿Qué es busy? No, que estoy ocupado. Ah, busy. Ok, so please, please, please. Let's try that. Ok. Ok. Um, let's go with the last sentence because it's time already. It's 10 already. So, yes, yeah, so we want to go, Mimir. Adán Antonio Ramírez Aguirre. Present, Miss. Ok. Carlos Amilcar Campos Palencia. Present. Daniel Enrique Sifontes Perdomo. Present. Edgar Edenil Sonreyes Portillo. Present, Edwin Alexis Pérez Hernández. Present, Miss. Esmeralda del Rosario Portillo García. Present. Gabriela Yamiret Ramírez Ceciliano. Present, Miss. Jonathan Stanles Pérez López. Present, Miss. Jorge Ernesto López Rivera. Present, Miss. José Ernesto Alemán García. Present, Miss. Karen Berenice Castro Avelar. Present. Marco Antonio Vanegas Corleto. Present, Miss. Mario Antonio Reyes Berganza. Present. Mario Cristóbal Quintanilla. Marlon Fabricio Flores Vargas. Marvin Enrique Arguello Joaquín. Present, Miss. Mauricio Antonio Rivera Rojas. Present, Miss. Miguel Ángel Cortés Campos. Present, Miss Diana. Noé Aníbal González López. Present, Miss. Noé Gabriel Pérez Martínez. Present, Miss. Salvador Orlando Veracruz Gómez. Present, Miss. Sara Raquel Chávez Morán. Present, Miss. Sergio Adolfo Hernández Rosales. Present, Miss. Isela Guadalupe Martínez Cruz. Okay, you guys have a good night and I will see you tomorrow, okay? Okay, good night. Bye. Okay, good night. Good night. See you. Good night. Bye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Miss. Bye, Miss bye. Castro. Bye, bye. Miss good Castro. night, Miss. Bye. -bye. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Ciao.